Right, this next trick is called and then some. I mean, that's a technical term, you can't quote me on that. Basically, if you're doing um, back to front finger spin, another spin can be achieved afterwards by momentarily catching with the third finger and then allowing the nunchucks to spin again over your hand. The words seldom do nunchucks justice, so I'll just, I'll just demonstrate. If you first spin, catch, and up. So just look up after the third spin, after the third spin, after the first spin, third finger catches, allows for another spin, like so. And also, when the third finger spin, the third finger catch happens, rather than doing a wrist spin, you can propel into an aerial. Like so.